what is going on guys single dad so here I've got a lot of stuff going on today so first of all I'm gonna be taking this Christmas tree down all these little ding 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 taking that down plus you can see all this sewing stuff that's gonna go upstairs I'm gonna go out and get a table I'm gonna get set up in my bedroom that way I can actually sew because if you can check this out this part right here see this little banister right there this part right here is the stairway Okay guys, got the sun directly in my face, but it's good lighting for you guys. Let me go over here, I'm gonna show you what I'm doing. I've got some spray paint cans that I bought a couple years ago, and um, really great spray paint. Some, that's even worse. What am I doing? <laughs> I don't know if that's the brand down here by my finger here. I don't know, it's been a while since I bought them. Anyway, I took this, it's called Kickin' Yellow, it says up top here. I took this, and I have horrible lighting, I apologize, and I went ahead and spray painted my props. I'm spray painting the props to the drone because it's impossible for me at this point to tell which direction it's facing. Um, I wanna make sure I get the right direction on it. I'm gonna let them dry, put them on, very little wind right now. I'm in the backyard. I'm not sure if I want to actually fly it in the backyard, but I probably will try it and hopefully you guys will see it. So Okay, so I figured out what I was doing wrong because I had the, let me grab this here. I had the drone on the cardboard box and the yellow propellers were lifting and the black propellers weren't doing anything. So I realized that when I took them off to weigh them, I put them back on the wrong, so I had it wrong. Um, so oopsies. <laughs> All right guys, so I went out just now and I thought that the weight of the paint might have an effect on it. Maybe it does, but there was a little bit of wind from the south. Paint helps, but once it's spinning, I just can't tell it fast. I mean, I just can't figure it out fast enough. So I'm gonna have to paint part of the frame of the drone that way, no matter what. So I'll have to figure that out. It's actually um, pretty cool that I got that accomplished. I think it looks pretty cool with the yellow um, props on it. Okay guys, so I've got like 4% battery left and I was just flying the drone and it got stuck. I'm not even sure where I'm looking at right now. It got stuck in the neighbor's tree. So I'm about to go get it out right now. Okay, so basically I just spent the last half hour trying to translate or 
or uh, allow my neighbor to understand what I'm saying. He speaks Italian. He's an older guy. Uh, I had to explain to him that the drone flew into his yard and landed in a tree about 12 feet off the ground, or I don't know how high. So we didn't have, we had a good conversation. I mean, it wasn't bad or anything, but I just don't think we really fully understood each other. So um, I should have recorded me taking it out of the tree, but I was like thrashing that thing. I'm surprised it's not broken. Um, that thing's really tough. Today's been great. I feel like I got a lot accomplished. Thanks for checking out the video. Thanks for watching, subscribing, doing whatever you do. You have a good one. See you later.